economy recovering, Mona, but not back to pre-pandemic levels. If you were to grade the health of the economy on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being excellent and 1 being poor, where would you rank this economy right now? Uh, yeah, you know, look, I, I think the economy is on a path to recovery, but right now we're still in early stages. We're probably at a, a 4 or 5 at the best. Um, you know, keep in mind, unemployment rate, even after tomorrow's jobs report, is probably likely 7.5%, uh, 7.6% or so. Um, GDP growth was phenomenal this quarter, but it's looking to moderate over time. Uh, we certainly have to get through, you know, this next period of um, the virus and, and an economy that may be hunkered down a bit, and we don't have stimulus on the table, and, you know, obviously the presidential election is still ongoing. So, what I do see is a 2021 that could look much better. And you're looking even at the uh, using the Fed's own uh, estimates, next year's GDP growth could look plus 4%. Earnings growth could be closer to plus 23%, according to estimates. Combine that with low rates and the potential for stimulus. Now, that's not a bad backdrop for risk assets. So we're probably four to five heading towards hopefully six, seven, and eight next year. And to put a point on that, David, as we look at the 10-year, which is inching up just a little bit after the Fed's decision, do you think rates are, are on the rise here or no? Well, I think they're lower and they will be lower than they would have been under a blue wave because divided government almost certainly means less fiscal stimulus. You know, a big fiscal package that Nancy Pelosi was talking about is less likely to get through under divided government. So you get less fiscal stimulus, you've got a more accommodative Fed because of it. So yes, you should get lower rates. I think that's, I think that's likely. Um, you know, and the, and the, as for grading the economy, you know, I'd probably give it a C. But it's you know, this is we're in in the uh, the pandemic economy. These read the midterms rather than the final grade. And uh, I think that when we get to, hopefully by ne by next fall, we come out of this, and I think the economy will be doing quite well at that point. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.